Hi and welcome to the second tutorial by YJComputerServices.com. Today we're going to be talking about the cloud. I know you guys may have heard a lot about the cloud. Basically, um, the cloud is a new type of computing. When I say new, I mean within the last, basically, last five years. The cloud computing is a fairly, very comprehensive technology. And I just wanted to make this tutorial because I know there's some people out there, including some of my friends and family, who do not know about the cloud and do not know how to use the cloud or how the cloud is used or how the cloud can help them in their computing activities or data activities or whatever whatever activities they may need at the moment. Okay, let's get started. I created this diagram right here. Let me put it on full screen for you guys. So let's start on this side. These are the servers. These are where the applications will be stored. For instance, the Apple iCloud. They released a new service called the iCloud. And whenever you sync your iTunes account and you sync it with your data or contacts or music, they said they will put it on their cloud. So this is where, for instance, with the Apple iCloud, this is where all your music will be and all your contacts will be on these servers, which are hosted by Apple, for instance, in this scenario. And after that, it goes down here into this string, which is the cloud. This is called the cloud. All these servers that have your data, including your contacts and music and photos, all go directly to the cloud, both servers. The cloud, mm, to, un to make you guys understand it better, the cloud can be understood as the internet. So once they connect to the cloud, you will then be able to use the internet to get to the cloud on your computer. I hope that helped you guys understand that. So in a nutshell, the cloud is basically like a second internet for you guys. The cloud, the cloud operates in a way that um, let me think of a way that I can explain this to you guys. The cloud operates in such a way that you won't have to you won't have to go to a certain place to get to your files. For instance, on the internet, you have to go to www.google.com to do to do a basic search for anything you're looking for. With the cloud, it will let you access it anywhere, no matter if it's www.google or www.google1 or google2.com no matter as long as you know where your cloud is you will be able to connect to it that's one thing about the cloud the second thing about the cloud is that for instance with the apple icloud subscription let's say you're at your mom's house and you want to be able to sync your ipod you would not be able to do that because your ipod is only allowed to be able to sync onto one computer and once that one computer is synced you cannot sync it on any other computer so that's another thing your files will be able to have to be easily accessible anywhere because they're all in the cloud. There is also another service offered by VMware. This is a little this is for my IT guys. The VMware also also offers a thing called the vCenter. The vCenter basically has servers and a cloud. But the difference between that is that's basically trying to create your own cloud technology. Well, not technology, your own cloud computing networking services. For instance, if you're the, just the consumer, you would only worry about the cloud. You wouldn't worry about the server. So the cloud has many ways in helping you guys, whether you need to, whether you need to have a website and you want it to be accessible between no matter where the person is at, and you want to make sure that it's always accessible, or if you have or if you have your own personal private cloud that maybe has websites or multiple websites you will be able to make your cloud smaller or bigger all depending on your client base I hope this video um, gave you guys more of an understanding about the cloud and how the cloud can be useful to you and as always you all guys are always welcome to visit our website at www.yjcomputerservices.com
Thank you guys. Bye.